Good morning. Today we're gonna make a bag. All right. Um, one design. Maybe you will like that. We can start. Let me get you the the one we want to make. You you want to make one like this? Okay. We're gonna put a pocket inside. We're gonna put a pocket outside. Um, it's gonna be all made out of natural fibers, hemp, and organic cotton. We're gonna start cutting the baiting because we're gonna put uh, some cushion in inside to make it fluffy, soft. Um, it takes like an hour to make this bag. We cut two of this, uh, the, the outside lining, we put under lining, so we cut two of them. Anywhere you want to put it, I try to do it uh, uh, straight in the straight with towards the graining line. I'll just cut. This is the cool part because you you see you get your pattern, you make your pattern, and then you. Put it in the fabric and you stitch. At the end, you'll see what's going to be. When we pick out fabric for the outside, what's going to be? This is uh, all natural hemp fabric that we can work with, and it's 100% uh, stretchy. Because I'm gonna, I'm planning on putting a lot of things in the bag, heavy stuff, and maybe you too. <laughs> to your computer. And I just cut the way it was the, the top one. See, I have the bedding in it. I just decided I'm cutting in there. And then I'm gonna make sure I even out both. So Remember what I say about having a pattern. Do you remember it's like really we have it even. That's the reason to have a pattern. We make it even everywhere. Well, my fabric is so I don't go to the other side. One, get those pins out. I mark from here to here, I'm gonna make pleats. So I put, I exactly know where I'm gonna make my pleats. So start from, this is the middle, I mark, mark the middle. Make sure that it's in all the, all the way around. This is where I'm gonna start to put my, my handle. And sometimes I just try to make it center everything where I'm done with the top pattern. I got this one then. This is the outside. Just gonna stitch these two together. That's the um, inside also. And really, I don't. Doesn't matter which way the grain goes. To go left or right, or whatever. And this one, I'm just gonna make it this way. You see, this one is a smaller and the length. Because the other one has to be longer, so the loop will come in, the, the string will come in. See, I'm done with this one also. Oh, before I get the pins off, I'm gonna do what I did to the other one to even out with, so I can find it out there. The other one.
if you don't put your little, <clears throat> you don't put little marks, you don't know where you're gonna start. So it won't go even. It will be all funky. I mean, that little exterior pocket. Make a pocket and side pocket, which is uh, the size is seven by six by eight. We can make it the same color or we can make it different, but I think we're going to make it the same color, same fabric, but we only need one, so we're not going to cut from this part, oh, because sometimes you have leftovers. Alright, your pocket is ready, and let's see in this one we, yeah, look, we have it. Enough to make the outside pocket. When I was learning about cutting, about making stuff, the first time that I was afraid to cut. Oh man, I'm gonna, what about if I'm not gonna make, I'm gonna mess it up. But you know, if you don't try, it's never gonna happen. Try it. And actually, it does, it just works fine. Don't be afraid of cutting it. It's just fabric. <laughs> we're gonna need one for the bottom, for the base. For this, we're gonna make this. We're gonna build this. Alright, give myself some fabric when I'm gonna do it. So I have to put some baby in the bottom. I'm going to cut some of the cushioning. The, the, the bag will be soft. This is uh, a bath, bathing like they, people use this for uh, quilts. This is all organic cotton or natural, all natural cotton only. So I cut one, put it in, 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 inside. You can make it without it, but I like to put one inside to make the, the bottom of the bag stronger. Let's say you're carrying a, a books, but yeah, let's say you're carrying a, a base and you put it in your bag. <laughs> then you forgot how fragile is and you drop it. So you know, you know we tend to put our bag everywhere. Boom. But this will help so it won't break. It will help with the cushioning. Okay, so we're done with this one. I am gonna put this inside. So what I do is just turn it like this and I put it like a sandwich. Batting goes in under inside. And making sure that the three of them are all together when I'm stitching I don't want to be even anywhere. Right, done with that. So we're going to make the handles. We're going to put the handles now. So let's see, you can use cloth or you can use this. See the little faces there? Right. You can customize any way you like. We're not going to make it from the same cloth fabric we're gonna put this one we're just gonna cut the same length because we're not gonna need to customize it it's already done just cut and cut two of them that's it we're done we're gonna start stitching now 